So, let's try this. So, a few weeks ago, I wrote this company that makes a very cool gadget for Miatas and I asked them if they could send me one so I can review it. Here is how it went. Bruh. So, in the box you get the control box with the wiring, some cable ties and a fancy instruction. By the way, the mod does not only work with the Mazda Miata, but also with the Mazda RX-7, so that's pretty cool. Ok, so now let's get to work. Step 1. Install the control box. Use the two big cable ties that come with the box and secure it in a dry and safe location. Step 2. Disconnect the battery. If you own a Miata, you probably know the battery is located in the trunk. Step 3. Disconnect the headlamp motors. Step 3.5. Realize the connectors are 30 years old and waste 10 minutes trying to get them loose. Step 3.6. Finally disconnect the headlamp motors. Step 4. Route the control cables. Make sure to avoid parts in the engine bay that may get hot. Try to lay the wire alongside the factory wiring. Step 5. Connect the wiring harness to the control box. Simply push it in and make sure it clicks into place. Step 6. Plug in the connectors between the old factory connectors. Make sure to place them that way, they are clear of any moving parts. Step 7. Realize that life is meaningless and everything you do doesn't matter anyways. Step 8. Secure the wiring with cable ties. And clip it. Step 9. Connect the battery again. And finally, step 10. Do the factory reset by pressing the headlight button 20 times. If done correctly, the lights should pop up one after the other. Alright, I got the app started up, let's test out the features. First of all, wink left, check, wink right, check, wink both together, check, wink left right, check, wink right left, check, double wink, yeah, looks good. Double wink, left, right. This <laughs> this looks kind of fun, I must say. Mexican wink, left, right. What is Mexican wink? Okay, whatever. And probably the coolest feature, the sleepy eye. cool thing about this, you can set it up actually, then you go to sleepy eye height and you can adjust it, like you can have a, a bit higher sleepy eye, let's check it out how it looks, yeah, okay, it looks not that sleepy that much, but yeah, I think at the setting 4 it looks the best actually. 
You can also adjust the height of the left and right headlight, so that's pretty cool. Like, let's say this is 18 and this is 14. Let's test this. So it looks drunk or something, I don't know. Still pretty cool. So let's set this to 15 and this to 15. Also, you don't need your phone to do these tricks. For example, you can push the headlight button four times to wink or three times for sleepy eye. So yeah, big thank you to MX5 Tech for sending me this little gadget. If you want to get it for your Miata, go to their website, I will leave a link in the description. Also, I know I haven't uploaded a single video on my second channel, but I promise you, as soon as the lockdown in my country is over, I will start uploading. Don't worry. If you want to check out my second channel, click right here. Or here, I don't know anymore. See ya. That doesn't make sense.